Okay, so now we will create a script for our single hand melee attack and then play this animation and give damage to the knight. Okay, so if you click on rifles right here, let's create a C sharp script by the name of single melee attack. If you click on player, let's drag and drop this script right here, okay? And let's open this up and let me tell you that the single melee attacks attack script will be similar to the fist fight script okay so what we can do is simply copy all of these line of code from this script okay and simply paste it right here then if we scroll up in this script we don't need this transform references and also we don't need this timer so we will remove this timer as well then for now we will deactivate this fist fight script okay because we want to focus on this single melee attack script okay so make sure that you deactivate that and then right here we will remove this if conditions okay and then let's change this function name to let's just say single melee moods and then in the update let's call this function as well single melee moods okay now we need to change the variable names as well so first of all we will change this fist fight value to single melee value okay we will leave the other variables as it is okay and right here we will remove this line of code as well then we need to change these methods name okay single fist double fist so let's start from the single fist okay as you can see the method name and the animator boolean name they are similar and if you notice the animator now for the single hand melee attack as you can see the boolean values are single attack one two three four five so we will do the same for this one now as well so if we double click on this single fist okay it will highlight this word okay then click on this change all occurrence and let's change this to single attack one okay so as you can see it is changed right here then inside this set pool as well and right here as well okay then let's change the double fist to single attack 2 let's change this one to single attack 3 ok then for the kick combo we will say single attack 4 and for the left kick we will change this to single attack okay so as you can see the name is changed everywhere now if you are not using visual studio code and if you don't have this option which is change all occurrence then just simply change the name right here okay and then right here as well the method name type that method name right here and then type the name of your animator boolean right here as well my names are similar so that's why I have used single attack one in the method name and for the animator boolean name okay so once you changed all of these names then right here change this wait for second time to 0 0.2 0 0.2 and in every wait for second property change it to 0 0.2 
and that will be it okay and as you know that we have deactivated the fist fight mode script so now whenever we press the mouse left button our player will play these animations which is the sword animation or you can say single melee animations okay but now we need to set the single hand attack active to true as well okay or else it will not go inside this substrate machine so in order to do that right here let's copy that if condition paste it right here okay and in here we will say that if the mouse left button is pressed then we will say anime dot set pool the pool name is single hand attack active so single hand attack active and let's set this to true and let me move this outside this if condition that is it if you now save the script get back right here now let's add the animator then the player script then right here it needs the attack area so if we check this animations as you can see the player A will be holding the sword in the right hand so for the attack area we will use the player right hand actually we have already added the reference to the right hand so we can click on that in the fist fight mode okay this is the right hand now let's simply try and drop it right there that's it and then for the attack radius we will set this to 0 0.9 and let's add the night layer right there as well and now before playing the game if we select this animation which is attack C forward 1H melee or you can say this single attack 3 okay right here remove this position XZ back into pose okay remove that click apply and that is it now let's play the game okay so now if we first of all select the knight and then let's press the mouse left button as you can see now the player is playing the animation okay the single hand melee attack is active now if we press it again as you can see the player is playing the animations okay and the reason I have removed that pick into pose from the single attack 3 is you can see right here is that now the player can move forward okay so now let's try to damage the knight okay let's move inside the circle and now as you can see we can damage the knight but the attack radius for this is really small so let me make this as 0 point or 1.2 and also if you click on the animator select this single attack 5 animation and from this one remove this peg into pose as well click apply that is it now let's test it again okay here is the player now let's get closer to the knight click on the knight okay and now if you try to hit the knight as you can see the knight health is decreasing okay whenever we hit the knight as you can see for now the player doesn't have the sword in the hand so in the next video we will be adding that as well so now with this done let's end this video right here